Hey, what's going on, fellas? How are we doing? So today we're going to talk a little bit about double play footwork from the second base position. Um, what we're going to look at is balls that are hit just to our left that we're going to pivot our feet on and make a good throw to the, to the shortstop. So the things, a couple things, couple key things here that you want to think about to help make this play a little bit easier for you. The first thing is when you field the ball, you're going to field it basically like like any other ball. So you're going to try to field the ball with your left eye. Going to sink your hips, get low, get your back flat. Biggest thing is to field the ball first. One thing I see happen a lot to players is they try to pivot and they try to throw the ball the second before they ever get the ball. So you have to field the ball first. You have to make sure of one. Okay. Once you field the ball and you secure the ball, now what you're going to do is you're going to pivot your feet. Now, when you watch guys do this, when you watch major league guys do this, guys that are really good at it, you'll see the pivot. They all pivot a little bit differently. So some some will pivot more here where they're more squared up to the shortstop. So basically as they're getting up, their chest is almost facing the shortstop. You'll see some players pivot a little bit more. You'll see some pivot a little bit less. But the biggest thing for me is when you pivot and you get your feet under you, you want to try to stay in your legs so you can throw the ball uphill. Okay? So let's back up again real quick. So we feel the ball. Bam, we're going to pivot our feet get our feet under us as quick as we can. The arm action is going to be a lot shorter on this than it would be on a normal throw across the diamond. So you can see he brings the ball pretty much towards his middle, maybe a little bit more. You know, we talk a lot, again, on routine ground balls, you're going to funnel the ball to the middle of your body. On this play, you can funnel the ball a little bit more towards, almost towards like you're going towards your right armpit so that when you break your hands, and you break thumbs down, your arm action will stay short, and the ball will come out quickly. So you can see he's, he's bringing it a little bit more to his more to his right, probably towards his right armpit. He's going to still take the ball out, though, right about there. So he's taking the ball out here. His thumbs are breaking down, so his hand's on top of the ball right there, you can see. So thumbs down, hand on top of the ball, and then the ball is thrown. All right. I talked about a second ago, throwing the ball uphill, really important. So you want to stay in your legs. You don't want to pop out of your legs. You want to stay in your legs, and you're going to throw the ball from a little bit lower slot than you're used to, or than you normally do. Most players will throw from a little bit higher slot than this. But you want to have a quick, short, tight arm action and throw the ball from a little bit lower of an arm slot because that's going to get the ball to go uphill. If you stand up, and take the ball out up here and throw from a high arm slot, you're going to throw the ball downhill. And it makes it difficult on the double on your double play partner when he has to turn that double play. The most difficult ball for him, if this was the receiver right here getting ready to catch the ball as a shortstop, anything below probably that line is difficult to turn a double play because now he has to decide, do I have to turn my glove over? You know, it makes it it makes it much more, much more difficult. It's much easier when the ball is above that line. Right? Your, your best ball is to hit the guy in the chest. But if you miss, you would rather miss high than miss low. You miss low and you get the ball around the knees, really, really difficult for the shortstop to turn a double play. If you miss high and you're up around the head or even a little bit higher than the head, it's still an easy turn for the shortstop. So we always tell our guys, stay in your legs, short arm action, throw the ball uphill. Um, make it easy on your double play partner, okay? And those really are, that's it. So if you break it down and really think about those main things, I'll play it a couple of times so you can see it here. We're going to field the ball first. We're going to pivot our feet. I'm going to break my thumbs, break with my thumbs down, short arm action, throw from a little bit lower slot, Stay in those legs, throw the ball uphill. That's it. If you worry about those four or five things, you'll make this play, you know, hopefully 10 out of 10 times. And again, this play is going to be made on a ball hit just to our left. We just have to move to our left a little bit. It's too far from a flip. We can't get our momentum going a second. So we're going to have to pivot our feet and make the toss. So let me know if you guys have any questions. Hopefully this helps you out. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Put your comments in the section below if you have any questions. Share with all your friends, all that good stuff.
and uh, we'll talk to you later.